Hi everyone, I've come outside, it's actually, well, it's pretty dark out at the moment and um, that rock I got the signal with the falcon, I smashed it um, into three pieces just now. So I'm still getting the signal off this piece. I think that's about all though, I think that's the only piece. So if I run the falcon over the other pieces where I've just broken it. There's nothing. But there's definitely one on there. So I've isolated the, uh, the target in there to that one piece. I can't actually see anything with the naked eye, but um, I'm not sure whether I'll do it now or tomorrow, but I'll probably do it tomorrow, I'd say, and I'll stick it through the dolly pot and just break it probably in half again, or three pieces, and then I'll stick it in the rock crusher and we'll set that in motion. That'll pulverize it in seconds, so. Then we can pan it off and see what's in there. So, yeah, well, um, hopefully, hopefully it's not too small. Hopefully it's not too small and it's a little picker. A little picker would be lovely. All right then, until tomorrow, we'll um, leave it at that. Thank you. Now today we are going to pulverise the pieces of quartz, as you can see here, that we found the uh, gold signal in yesterday. And I've got some other bits of quartz there too that I'm going to put in the dolly pot. So what we do is we grab the rock, stick it in the dolly pot there, we use our metal bar to smack the crap out of it to break it down to smaller pieces and then we feed it into the bolt stone pulverizer um, I bought this from the mining exchange gold shop in Ballarat so um, yeah they're a pretty awesome thing I haven't actually used this yet but I've seen them um, and all I do is connect that to my battery operated angle grinder sorry listen to the birds <laughs> So um, just make sure you don't have the battery in it when you hook it up inside, which is how I wind it onto the machine anyway. Inside we have a couple of chains that spin around really quick and smash the rocks to dust. Basically that's what it is. So all we'll be doing is feeding the material in through the top and just giving it a gentle shake. Um, yeah, and that's it. And then I'll just tip it into here and then pan it off. So let's just see how we go. So I'm going to have to do this in sections. I can't keep it running because I'm using my phone. But um, I'll dolly up a bit of rock and then I'll, I'll show you the machine. Okay, so here's our piece from yesterday. We isolated the target. And if I just get the uh, falcon again. Be able to hear the target. So it's definitely on that edge. So I'm going to put in the dolly now and give it a smash, and then um, I'll pulverize it and we'll see what's in there. Okay, so here's the dolly pot, here's our piece of quartz with the target signal. Chuck it in there and and um, I don't know how I'm going to tip this out of one hand. Yeah, 
there, that's out of the dolly. And now I might turn the falcon back on and see if I can isolate a piece. It'd be great to be able to see it before I stick it in the uh, before I stick it in the machine. Let's see if we can find it. Buzz, 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 buzz. It's a very sensitive machine, that one. All right. Okay, so it's still in here. Oh yes, yeah, see, that's got louder. So, I still can't see anything yet. I thought there might have been a tiny little nugget or something in there, but... Oh well, oops, sorry, it's not even in front of the camera. But, um, okay, into the machine she goes. Taking the battery off. Now I just want to make sure that's pretty empty. Yeah, it's pretty empty. And that's what it ended up as just a powder. So now I'll go and get a pan and we'll pan it off and see what's in there. Okay, we'll be back. Now I've put that crushed rock into the banjo pan, another great. Um, invention is the banjo pan so um i don't really want to wash it all completely away i'm just gonna let that water run out for a minute though and i'm gonna leave all that rock in there but i am going to show you if it's found anything I know this is not how you, the banjo pan's designed to work, but I just want to look for the gold, not actually process it out just yet. I just want to see if there's any colour. And if so, how much colour. So I'm just going to swish the water and start removing some of this sand down to the bottom. So I can start looking for colour. Now hang on a minute everybody, my um, arm is getting sore. Alright, here we go. There are some metal flecks in there, but that's just from the dolly pot, but they are uh, easily removed with a magnet. You remember this is just um, that little tiny piece of stone I put in. It's all I put in, that little bit of rock. You can see flecks of metal from the dolly pot. Now we're right down towards the end. And there's a piece of gold just starting to show there now. Oh, I don't know if I can show you that. That's actually a piece of gold just there. Tiny little speck of gold just where's my camera? That's a speck of gold just in front of my finger there. Oops. Now because I'm not using any soap, 
you will see I don't know if you can see that hang on where are we uh, just in front of my finger there there's something oh I just made it sink there was a piece of gold floating anyway and that's why we normally put something like a bit of soap in the water just to break the surface tension but yes there's certainly gold in there so I'm going to go and pulverize the rest of it and um see how much more we can find but that's that's one there it's only small actually i might pause this and get the falcon and just prove to you that it can pick up a piece that small i mean that is so small i can't even focus on it that is so small that's there like that is the piece of gold i'll go get the falcon okay i've gone and got the probe the falcon And there's just a tiny little bit here. Probably can't even see it. And there's a tiny little bit now. Where's my finger? It's on my finger. It's so bloody small. It's like a little round. There it is. And the falcon. Picks that up quite well, actually. So there we go. So I'm going to go and crush the rest of the rock up now and see what else we can find. But that little piece in there is about as small as the piece on the card here. Actually, I reckon it's smaller. <laughs> that That's telling you something, isn't it? That shows how small it is. Can you see that on the... Just in front of my thumb there. Hang on, where's the camera? Just in front of my thumb, right? That's it there. That's the piece of gold. It is so tiny. So tiny. And the falcon picks that up, no worries. So that's quite surprising. It's a there's the two pieces together. And the falcon picked that up. I'm just absolutely surprised. So there we have the falcon, the rock pulverizer, the banjo pan, and the gold that it found. Amazing. Thanks for watching.